Hi, so today I'm going to make a um, burgundy fascinator. So you'll need a little fascinator base, whether you've pre-made that or pre-bought that. Um, some cinema, and this measures cinema triangle. So all I've done is folded the edges. So before folding them, it measures eighteen inches, which is forty six centimeters. Obviously, that's the same. by 34 centimetres unfolded and this length measures 23 inches which is 58 centimetres but you don't have to have exact, exactly those measurements so fold those edges and steam them or iron them so that they stay in place and the stiffener in the cinema gets to work and seals the corner so I've already pre-ironed this so you'll be folding it in a minute so first start with you'll also need your headband, I'm using a thin silver metal headband and three ivory flowers. And you'll obviously you need your needle and thread. So find where you want to sew your headband on. Like this good. We're gonna have the point at the, the bottom of the hat and start sewing. So once you've sewn on your headband to the hat base you can start with your cinema triangle fold it almost in half like so then sort of fold it across and try and scrunch this over so you're getting sort of a 3D effect. Then I always fold the end in. And that's when I'll sew that bit. And then sew it onto your hat. Get it to where you think it looks nice when you wear it. Just a bit. So now I'm going to sew this bit onto the hat. So there we have it. In the end I decided to just put two roses on. I felt free, made it a bit too bulky. Hope you managed to make yours as well. Hope you like it. Please like and subscribe if you like these videos and you want to see more. And I'll see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye.